six, one, ten, no one And we keep on going Cause it never ends And the sky won't stop wiping We're closing in The center cannot hold And neither can we So long to the old ways And hello to me We started something, yeah We started something new Didn't know what it was Now we don't know what to do Think it's over, yeah Think it's done, but you're wrong Cause the past never dies Till you put it in the ground I called out your name as we walked through the cathedral Thought you my lover, and you thought me your friend. The air smelled of pine as we drove through the needles. How long ago did you know this would end? And so that's when we started something, yeah. Started something new Didn't know what it was Now we don't know what to do Think it's over, yeah You think it's done, but you're wrong Cause the past never dies So you put it in the ground Started something, yeah We started something new Didn't know what it was Now we don't know what to do Think it's over, yeah You think it's done, but you're wrong Cause the past never dies So you put it in the ground So, uh, what's the band been up to last year? Mostly garage sleeping and <laughs> I don't know. Fuck, maybe we can't do the interview. Know, yeah. <laughs> oh my god! Just <laughs> okay. Maybe I don't want to I'm better at reacting than uh, <laughs> than looking at the camera and telling you what I think is on my mind. So I don't know. <laughs> Well, let me tell you about what Modern Folklore has been up to the past year. Right. We've been practicing a lot. We've got a couple new members. We recently added Kyle here on the fiddle and guitar and keys. And then Pat recently joined us on the bass guitar. Right. Mm -hmm. So we've been getting up to speed on that stuff. Uh, we've been recording an album that's due to come out hopefully in November at some point. And then just really practicing a lot and trying to find our sound. Mm -hmm. Learn how to sing harmony. That's been a new thing. Yeah. Like, like just we all Eagles. sucked before, but like Pat joined, and it's like, oh hey, we can, yeah, we can sound like the Eagles. We're, we're great. <laughs> it's our favorite. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Which means we suck a little bit less. <laughs> yeah, we're basically the Eagles. Mm -hmm. Definitely. I, can I be Joe Walsh? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, totally. Cool. I think Joe Walsh had pink hair. Yeah. He would. Yeah. <laughs> so, for sure. Cool. I won't believe in God above
What do you guys want to experience within the next five years? Each other's bodies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It'd be cool to get paid. The highs and lows of prostitution. <laughs> and <laughs> right. I would honestly go for any of those. Mm -hmm. yeah. Those all sound pretty nice. That's what this is the 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 train to take us to is really just so we can yeah experience um, alternate universes um, like with Adam Chandler. Adam Chandler. Adam Chandler. Yeah, Adam yeah. Adam Chandler's who Probably we really would like to meet. Influence. That's the good. Enlightenment, Nirvana. I heard those things come yeah. with uh, enough musical <laughs> practice. I would like that. Yeah, that sounds I nice. I think Chandler said that in his book, actually. I think mm -hmm. you're right. Yeah. Chandler did say that. He was talking about how when the when the veil thins enough, you can reach across and see your sister standing there with a, a, a box of apples. And if the box of apples are fully red, then that means you are a cat. Sister or oh. stepsister? I mean, that's one of the like the three Chandlerisms that are like the big ones they teach. Yeah, hey, it's one of the cats. three. I can't remember the other two. <laughs> Hello, guy. Oh, you want to get up here? Come on. And dog Come on. We definitely want I don't more dog dog gets up here too, man. <laughs> Stop provoking. I'm gonna provoke. I want the dog. What inspires you guys? <laughs> That's what you should Josh ask. Josh has beautiful hair. Yeah, Josh That's does it. have beautiful hair. Those inspire the hell out of me. Mm -hmm. Well, when I was 12, I went in the basement one time. I you said we were going to talk about this oh, guy. <laughs> That's the tape story, I think. This <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, oh, well, what's it, what, what's yeah, yeah, I was 12, I went down to the basement and I found this box of tapes, you know? Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, I never played an instrument in my life and uh, I found this one tape called Scalaluya. And, uh, you know, I put it in, man, and it was pure bliss in my ears. <laughs> and I never looked back, you know, <laughs> I dropped out of college, I was 12. <laughs> and then and we, we all remember we had like a, a shared dream of Kyle discovering that and Scalaluya. that like, yeah. That definitely, you know, it, it put it is an yeah, arcane age self, you yeah. know, to perform like that. It never happened actually. I just remembered it once they had the dream. Yeah, mm -hmm. we, we actually started off as a Christian ska band, mm -hmm. and then our sound dramatically changed. Um, Josh had a pretty intense car accident mm -hmm. and came out with a couple plates in his head. Yeah, um, you can hear it right here. Right. If I rap on his head right there. Yeah, um, actually, but, but like it's discovering really good, that like, resonation ride symbol sometimes like it's like a, just like a thud like a, instead of mm -hmm. the, the side of the snare I know what you, you know? mean yeah it, like it just it gets this good click that but that's how I write my my melody is like if it if it harmonizes and vibrates with the plates of my head I know it's a good tune so yeah and everything we write harmonizes with mm -hmm. the plates in Josh's head indeed mm -hmm. and Chandler a, and Scully I think it's about <laughs> 432 hertz yeah right in there <laughs> 